This is headquarters. You're home away from home and the center of your time here off the front line. If you're not out there in the field, this is your place to advance your career. So gear up, train hard, and get to know your fellow soldiers. We're well supplied, but you've got a lot to learn. Every man and woman on this beach knows this was just the first step in pushing back the Germans. We're counting on you to help us push through to the Rhine. I'm Captain John P. Andrews, and I'm here to recruit you to the U.S. Army Infantry. As infantrymen, you will experience more combat. I'm Captain John P. Andrews, and I'm here to recruit you to the U.S. Army Infantry. As infantrymen, you will experience more combat than any other branch in our multinational force. You will be the tip of the spear. For that reason, you will receive individual skills training and be made fit to fight. The instruction you will receive emphasizes individual rifle marksmanship and hand-to-hand -hand combat, so you will be able to engage the enemy at any range. At longer engagement distances, you will rely on your skills as infantry riflemen to destroy the enemy. Up close, you will receive instructions on how to fight with the bayonet. Sweat in training saves blood in battle. As long as you have your brothers in arms and your rifle, you are unstoppable. And if something tries to stop you, show them what a bayonet can do to anything in the way. Let's get to work. Welcome to the Airborne. We are the most well-trained, physically fit, and battle-ready unit in the U.S. Army. Being a Sky Soldier requires peak physical fitness, mental and emotional toughness, and unhesitating courage. It doesn't get any more dangerous than this. We're the first in the fight, and we're the last thing opposition wants to see. We are hunters from the sky. If you think you've got the guts, then gear up, get on board, and let's go kick some Axis ass. Pay close attention. The sooner we get the introductions out of the way, the sooner we can get to blowing things up. My name is Major James Parks of the Royal British Armoured Division. Our armoured forces have one mission, and one mission only. Engage and destroy the enemy. We specialise in direct combat with opposing armoured forces, strong points, and fighting positions. And we're also frequently called upon to provide for direct fire support for our comrades in the infantry. A weapon that is issued in our branch down to the squad level is the light machine gun. As a member of the armored division, it will be your duty to clear the way for our brothers in arms. If we don't do our job, then they can't do theirs. We fight for king and country, but most of all, we fight for each other. It is an honor to be armored. Never forget that. Now, let's get started, shall we? Welcome, soldiers to the Canadian Mountain Division, the most elite unit in the entire Allied Armed Forces. If you want to run headlong into access strongholds, try the infantry. But if you want to make your shot count, then we have a place for you. You are the eyes of the unit. You take in everything. The whole world lives between your crosshairs. Find your vantage point and execute the mission. They can't hear us, they can't see us, by the time they detect us, it's too late. If you have a keen eye and a steady hand, if you have the patience to wait for the perfect shot, if you can quiet the world around you and do what needs to be done, then look nowhere else but the Mountain Division. Attention, welcome to the Resistance. We do not have the luxury of time as our enemies are closing in. So I will be brief. We are the pioneers of a new expeditionary force, specializing in sabotage and covert operations. We operate by night, raiding supply points for weapons and explosives, including the incendiary shotgun shells that spark flames, creating a hailstorm of fire that consume our enemies. If you want to join us, you must be willing to sacrifice everything for the good of your countrymen. We are the French Expeditionary Force. We are the fire that will burn down the Axis Empire to the ground. Vive la Résistance. Vive la France. <laughs> 